Hello, bonjour. My name is John Steen. I'm Associate Professor in Strategic Analysis at the University of Queensland and currently Visiting Scholar at the University of British Columbia. Since 2012, I have been researching oil and gas mega projects in Australia. Uh, there have been about $200 billion worth of investment uh, in these projects. And it's important because they are very big, they are complex. Australia is a very challenging place to work in. So we were interested in how the projects are adapted and how the adaptation occurs as challenges emerge. Over the five years between 2012 and 2017, we conducted the research in several phases. There are many projects going on simultaneously. Uh, it's quite a unique opportunity to study mega projects because of the concurrency of several projects at one time. We really wanted to understand these mega projects as ecosystems because while there might be a consortium of companies owning the project, uh, usually a big oil company in partnership with a a local company. There is actually an industrial network around these projects and the way that this network is coordinated has a big influence on how the project succeeds or actually struggles. So we did research, uh, survey research on the, uh, the network of companies around the, the major project and we also did a survey of the project owners. One thing that was quite interesting uh, at the beginning was how different parts of the ecosystem we're identifying different problems. And I think what this says is that when a mega project is so large, it's very hard for the project owner to understand what's going on in that entire network. So one thing we were very interested in when we saw that is, well, what does it take for a project owner to actually respond in a timely way to problems that were emerging within the network? The main finding from our research is that agility in mega projects is very important. And mega projects can be agile in mainly two ways. One is that they are structured in a way that uh, doesn't compartmentalise the project and also the leadership and the experience is very important of the ownership team. They have to be very good at actually being able to get into the project and into the ecosystem to understand what is going on. I think what is important about the findings from the research is that it encourages rethinking of the delivery models um, away from a reliance on forward planning and simply just operating the plan. Innovation is important, uh, responding to challenge is important and having the flexibility to do that and the experience and capability to do that is important. To structure an agile project means to change the delivery model uh, to be more flexible. <laughs>